20th anniversary half cabs and while I've got a few IDs on order this one just arrived that's right I went ahead and did a Spizike when the Spizike first arrived at Nike ID it sold out both online and in the studio in less than 24 hours I'm not sure why I'm not sure if they sold that many because I would have thought I would have seen pictures of these before we recently got samples in at Nike ID in Dallas and I know that they had sold out online last week from what I read yet they're still available in the Nike studios so at least we're finally getting a little bit more capability to do one that's not a Nike alone it's more of a Jordan so we're heading in the right direction as far as potentially getting retros to ID one day I'm hoping for the threes or fours the day I can do a three I'll go in there and just spend everything I got doing threes I'm sure I won't be able to help myself now back to these Spizikes problem with it for me is that they're very limited on colors there's a black a white and a navy blue upper that you can use and very limited on this side panel as well so you're basically stuck with three overall colors and then a little bit of options the orange and the blue fit together there's six different colors of elephant although I can make a blue here and here I cannot separate them and make them either or the orange stripe the gray midsole, just to set it off a little bit, yeah, I went with uh, what seems to be a theme this year. Call it Mets, call it Knicks. Some people called it Cavs on the fours recently. I don't really see that, but hey, maybe I don't want to. The icy clear blue sole on the bottom. Of course, it's a three sole. They do have solid colorways as well, but I thought that lighter gray underneath this overall icy blue would really help add to the pop on these. Trying to make something with it with very limited options, as I said. The blue Mars. Originally I had some elephant in here at the top, but I decided instead that that uh, darker blue was the right way to go as far as my choice. The six tongue. Now they do have laces and you have to be careful because when you first pull it up you see different colors of laces. Click that gray box when you're building and find that there are six colors of elephant laces. These are the orange elephant laces. No, I did not buy blue ones to go with it, although that would have been appropriate. I bought a second pair of orange elephant laces just because I think the overall, with all of the blue that I've got in certain places, the orange will always stay there. And that frees me up to do a second shoe of mine at my choice whenever I had to find the right one and utilize that second pair of orange elephant laces so they're in the bag to be used on a future shoe. Now, normally the ID is on a hang tag for an Air Force One or somewhere on the tongue for another. Something that's good and bad on the Debray's is where you can ID your shoe, Sam Colt. Unfortunately, only four letters on each one max. So it worked out to split it up with Sam Colt for Sam Colt 12. Although, realistically, I would have liked to have done Sam Colt 12 on both of them and that kind of thing. Can't have everything we want. Blue Jumpman, of course. I was asked earlier in the photos. Uh, the leather. For 210 I must say that I would prefer to have a little bit better leather and I'd like a little bit better um, right out of the box quality. You can see these look creased already and they have not been on feet. So overall a little bit of a, a let's complain about all right really for 210 that's what we get the quality should be a little bit more pristine in my opinion nevertheless these will be worn very soon they will be creased even more so it's a minor complaint overall 
Yet, before the larger price tag that we're paying for these, we should get just a little bit better quality materials, in my opinion. It is what it is. Very happy we can make a Spizike. I would like to see the uppers available in orange, red, purple, lime green. Original samples I saw had a lime green. It was a black with a lime green striation in their elephant print and also some access to a lime green that I could utilize down here along the way. So I believe that one day there should be much more options. I'm hoping for them and I will instantly do a second one. Overall, happy with the way it came out. Glad I do have a Spizike ID. Can't complain very much. Spizike IDs. As always, you can reach me at samcolt12.com, Google+, Instagram, and Viddy as well. 20th anniversary year of the half cab. Nike IDs continuing to roll. Still have another Air Force One or two. And a KD-4 in the box, a Year of the Dragon. In some ways, uh, using the orange and the blue was a theme for me as well, staying along these lines. Nike ID, Spizikes, Sam Colt 12.